Hey guys, Johnny with OhioCannabis.com. I'm at the Great Lakes Filter Booth here with Joe. Uh, Joe's got, he's the, you're the head engineer, right? Yes. Yeah. And this is a really neat odor control system. It's totally different than a uh, regular carbon filter. So tell us a little bit about it, Joe. So the OxyPure filter deployment is the result of 20 years of research from a research and development company headed by Dr. Jeff Williams. He's a professor emeritus from Michigan State University, a world-renowned microbiologist. He's worked his entire career on waterborne pathogens to try and clean water for third world countries and any countries. If you fly Lufthansa Air, his technology is in the water that you drink. That's cool. So Jeff met me in 2000 at the IMTS show, which is the International Machine Tool Show in Chicago. And he was trying to deploy it for metalworking fluids. Um, over the years, we had several different stops and political issues, so what we evolved to is uh, bringing it to Great Lakes Filter, it's a 70-year-old filtration company. It's a, it's a technology company, an engineering company, yeah. and uh, they also manufacture textiles, so it's a good Here match. in Detroit, or here in Michigan? Hillsdale, Michigan is our factory, and Bloomfield Hills is our corporate office. Okay. And uh, Matt Utley, the president of the company, is uh, him and I went to college together, so nice. We, uh, we met up at this, uh, at this company and we brought this I brought the technology to the company. What it is is a nano coating, right? So everybody knows what nano means. Mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> we're using the active ingredient in chlorine that does the disinfecting. We put it in a dry form. We combine it with a compound called N-halamine, N-halamine. Basically, we take what's called non-woven filter media, which is like your home furnace filter, okay. right? And we pleat it into a cartridge like that, okay. and then we put it into a vessel. And 100% of the VOCs that touch that surface don't get past that surface. Oh. So what we do is we neutralize gases, we don't absorb them. Carbon, and we don't have anything against carbon. We're in the carbon business. We have carbon filters here. Great, yeah, it's great. But all filtration should be staged filtration. Each filter should do its own particular job. So in the perfect world, you would have a particle filter that grabs flying debris. Then you would go through the OxyPure filter, which would neutralize all the gases. And then when you go through a granulated activated carbon to get that clean, fresh all air smell. Air, yeah, polish yeah. it up. Right, right. So we're... <clears throat> Excuse but me. this is still a total replacement for carbon if you want to. Absolutely. Um, I am going to be a Class C license holder, hopefully, if I pass through the state of Michigan, my application's in. Mm -hmm. um, and when I deploy this technology, however, I am going to have staged filtration, including granulated activated carbon, okay. downstream of this filter. But for a small grower who has odor complaints from friends, family, their girlfriend won't stay over, or all that kind of stuff, wow. those are stories we've heard. Um, you go from smelling the skunk smell to not smelling anything but the faint scent of like a pool. Wow, that's pretty cool. And I know with a lot of filters this size are going to weigh about 60, 70 pounds, fill up with carbon. And I think uh, Ryan was saying this is one's about 20, 25 pounds with the it's filter? It's 20 pounds with the filter. The filter's four pounds of that weight. Wow, so, so you buy the vessel once and then uh, they last about six months and then you replace the, uh, the cartridges. Okay, cool. Where can people go to reach you to find out more info? www.oxypure.com. Okay, cool. Well, hey, we appreciate the time, and that was really good info, and I think it's a great product. So. MC5. <laughs> Thanks, guys. See ya.